So it has been about almost 11 months since the iPhone 13 has been out. And since the first day I got this phone, I actually have not put a case on it. So I wanted to give a quick little re-update on how my iPhone has been holding up. It got really scratched up the first month, if you all remember that. And let's just go and see, I guess almost a year later, but we'll just call it 11 months for now. Now, luckily for me, there are no cracks or major things that are wrong with it. I've dropped this phone heavily. I've pretty much been using this iPhone as my secondary device. And at a quick glance, there's not really anything super crazy wrong with it, which is really good. But we are going to go ahead and zoom in and we're going to go and take a look. Now, starting off with the front, there really isn't, like I said before, any major scratches. I did just kind of wipe the display down, but I'll go and wipe it down one more time. So this is with the display almost completely wiped down and you can see if I go and bring it into the light like here, you can see there are a few different scratches for the most part, but they're not anything crazy. But if you see, I mean, one notable one is right there, right in the center right there. I kind of scratched it up, I think the first week or two I bought it and ever since then it's been there. But other than that, it's not really anything super crazy. Looking at the bottom, I'm trying to get it so you can kind of see the display, but there really isn't anything major flawed with it or major wrong with it, which is always really good to see. So the front panel, besides that one scratch up there, is pretty good. I mean, looking at it in my viewpoint as well, there are a few scratches like right there, right here a little bit as well. But otherwise, the bottom also has a few like specks of dirt, but other than that, it looks good. In terms of the chassis around the phone, it's almost in the perfect condition. I'm looking at it right now. There really isn't anything crazy wrong with it. And like I said, I've compared this phone to many other devices. I've held this phone up against many other devices. I've scratched it, you know, completely put it in drawers where it's scratching along other phones. You know, I've carried it around a lot of places and luckily for me, still nothing, you know, no cracks or scratches. I haven't had a crazy big drop on like concrete or anything. So luckily nothing like that has happened. It's usually just been drops on like this one, a table, you know, windowsill, floor with carpet on it. And now we're on the back. So let me wipe this down one more time. So we can see right here, we do have the two cameras set up up top and luckily still not too many scratches. Everything looks pretty good right there. I just saw a fly. And on top, again, nothing else is really that scratched up, which is like I said before, really good to see. Just some smudges from earlier. On the bottom, you can see as well, nothing super bad. As you can see, even if I go to this angle, nothing is really standing out to me that this is a really scratched phone. There's one little thing right here that I think was just like a you know piece of like lint or something. But otherwise, this device on the side looks really good. And that's kind of it. Luckily for me, there hasn't really been too, like too many crazy issues or anything like that. Like I said before, I think there were a few things where I like scratched this phone like crazy, but otherwise it's held up very well for the last, you know, almost 11 months. Now, would I recommend using this phone without a case? Absolutely not. I would always recommend putting a screen protector and a case on any phone that you buy or plan on using as your main device. But I will say for a majority of the iPhones that I've owned, the iPhone 13 has held up fairly well. It got really scratched up the first few, like I would say two months. But after that, it hasn't really been super scratched up. I think maybe I've been taking a little bit better care of it. But I also don't remember doing that at all. I just remember just kind of using this one ever, which way I'd use it, you know, with other phones too. So that kind of covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.